The buzz around artificial intelligence, AI, often revolves around flashy headlines of self-driving cars and sentient robots. But what gets lost in the hype, is the vast and diverse landscape of AI itself. AI is not one uniform entity. It is a collection of several techniques, each with its strengths and weaknesses. Neural networks and large language models dominate the headlines these days. However, the most effective and human-centric AI applications come from techniques that are lesser known to the public. These include Bayesian belief networks, Bayesian decision networks, genetic algorithms, rule-based systems, case-based reasoning and more. Unlike the black box nature of neural networks, these lesser known AI technologies offer transparency and trust. Bayesian belief and decision networks, with their interconnected nodes and probabilities, make their reasoning visible. We can see how they arrive at conclusions, strengthening our trust in their decisions. Genetic algorithms, inspired by natural selection, read solutions, mimicking our own iterative process of learning and creating new things. Rule-based systems, built on human-defined rules, follow a clear logic, further enhancing transparency. This openness is crucial for AI applications interacting with humans, allowing us to understand and trust their recommendations. Case-based reasoning learns from experience, drawing on past successes and failures, to give us perspective and help us make decisions regarding new challenges. Fuzzy logic, offering a bridge between words and numbers, mirrors our own understanding of the world, where things aren't always black and white. Markov chains are probabilistic systems, modeling random processes evolving over time. The Markov decision process, with its roots in decision theory, offers a framework for modeling decision-making in realistic scenarios involving uncertainty. All of these systems are founded on mathematics, science, and human knowledge. Furthermore, they are fully transparent to the user which not only enhances trustworthiness, but is also a firm requirement in many professions. Because these techniques also resonate with how humans think and work, they feel relatable, familiar, like extensions of our own cognitive abilities. This is why we feel it is so important to introduce these AI methods, especially to systems engineers, project managers, CEOs and their management team, healthcare providers, and especially doctors. This isn't to say that neural networks and large language models lack value. In fact, they excel in certain specific domains, like image and language processing. However, they are black boxes. Sometimes they are even factually incorrect. Another challenge with neural networks is that initially, there isn't any data or knowledge in the system, so they require extensive training, by examples, before they are able to perform any job. This is a serious limitation. Not every field or application have the necessary databases for training neural networks. These databases are normally in the range of at least a few thousands for small networks, and up to hundreds of thousands and sometimes even beyond that, if the network is required to do difficult tasks with acceptable reliability. Many AI researchers believe that the future of AI lies, not in a single dominant technology, but in diversity and collaboration between separate and complementary AI techniques. And when it comes to helping engineers, managers and doctors to make better decisions, why wait 50 or more years before AI can perhaps replace them? We have the tools to help these professionals today. AI techniques are here to boost their work and mental abilities. This is the main message of this introduction. And the videos on this channel, provide examples of how this can be accomplished.